Good evening viewers, I'm 21st Century Cats. Today I'm in Bath and today I'm with YouTube friend Andy Mooseman. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, well Andy's down in Bath, he's travelled down from Hastings and he says, Steve, can you show me the best that uh, Bath has got to offer? So obviously, I brought down the pub. And at the moment, we're in the Salamander, enjoying a good pint of Barnstormer. And your view of the Barnstormer? Uh, you were saying earlier, it's one of the ones that yourself and Andy, uh, Mr Funny, voted your favourite ale, oh, is that correct? We did, the problem now is we've probably peaked too soon, because now it's going to go downhill, this is my favourite beer. Yeah. Perhaps we just stay here all afternoon, the, the tour of well, Bath it's, it's will stay... Bit, that's the trouble with these things, you go in a pub and you, it is a nice pub, it's, it is a nice beer. No, I like the rabbit on it as well, that's <laughs> yeah. material, I don't know, but... Uh, well, here we are in Bath, and I just want to know, where the hell is Andy? Andy, where are you going, what are you doing? Cathedral, look. Nice, isn't it? It is very nice, but come on, you can see cathedrals anywhere. The pub's this way. Pub, this way. Well, viewers, the cultural tour of Bath uh, continues. At the moment, we're in the Raven pub. Now, when in Rome, wear a toga. When in the Raven, you drink a pint of Raven beer. And the pie mince the pie. Get in there. But I see, Andy, you're going for the healthy option there. Yeah, yeah, I've gone for the ploughman's option. What's that, yeah. what's that all about? Well, it just looks nice. Well, I've got more than you. That was the Raven. That was a bit more bath culture. That was right. I like that. That's nice. Yeah. Just the kind of culture you're after, or were you hoping for a bit, a little bit more? Well, I'm, I'm coming round to this side of the culture. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> let's face well, it. Andy, you've come all this way from Hastings. It's your day. Guess where I'm going to take you next? Uh, Roman baths? No, 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 no. And the Pulteney Bridge? No, no, no. Uh, the the Abbey? No, no. Even better than that, I'm going to take you to the Huntsman. Good home cooked food, open all day. Yeah, okay. I know. I know we've eaten already, but <laughs> beer's good, yeah. Well, I hope so. Yeah. Like I said, Andy, the best that Bath's got to offer. Well, I'm not so sure. Why? What's your problem? Well, we go in there. He's, Steve says we're going to Huntsman, as you just seen. Yeah. We go in there. They've got one real ale on. Well, I haven't got it on because it's actually not working. Is that so, my I mean, fault? Sort of, I didn't come all this way to go. You know, if we are going to go to pubs instead of seeing the culture and the tourist attractions, at least take me to someone that's worth going to. God. He's not happy. He's not happy. <laughs> Sorry, Andy, but you stuck with me for another two and a half hours. Your train's not till <laughs> half five. Now, to be fair, Andy. Another what, another lion? Yeah. Are you standing outside the shop? They're everywhere, aren't they? Do you remember the camel that fell over in a pub? Oh, and some bloke said, What's that lion there? He said, It's not a lion, it's a camel. Oh, <laughs> two humps, please. Oh, dear, dear. But anyway, so to be fair, Andy, we have been struggling to find pubs, but it is a bit of a maze around. Decent ones. Decent ones, yeah, ones that sell beer. <laughs> but it is a bit of a maze, but there is one behind us, yeah. ironically named, or coincidentally, the Cor de Lion. Lionheart, isn't it? Smallest pub in Bath as well. Oh, great. Is that what it says? Yeah. That's just is what that, we want. Is that a claim for fame? Obviously. That's not like their way of saying we've got no space. Yeah. Well, Andy, what do you think about this? The uh, alleged smallest pub in Bath. Well, I was just saying it probably was the smallest until they put the more seating upstairs in. Right, Andy, well, you've seen the Royal Crescent. I've what seen it before, actually. So why did we come all this way to see it? <laughs> because I haven't seen it for about 20 odd years. I must say, it looks tattier <laughs> than the last time I saw it. It doesn't look quite so spruce. Right. Uh, I think that's the right word, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. All right. It so is a nice spot, though. It is, I mean, it's a nice... Uh, yeah, like you said before, to any of our American viewers, if you came to Bath, this yes, is almost this certainly... Is one of those places you come to. One of the places you would go to if you came to this place. Uh, but enough of that, I reckon there's beer to be drunk. We've only got about another hour or so. Yeah. But like I say, it's not everywhere you can buy a, you know, drink a pint of beer, is it? Well, no. No, is there the Royal Crescent Arms around here somewhere? Bound to be. Bound to be. See, look at that. Perfect Crescent. Not just a street, not just a row of houses. It's a row of houses in a bit of a curve. Why didn't they just build it in a straight line then? You seem to know so much. Uh, 
Well, it's a bit. It's, it looks different, doesn't it? I mean, straight. Yeah, everyone does straight lines, don't they? That's like. I mean, so straight lines are boring, aren't they? I mean, so straight lines are very Roman. Maybe it was a. Uh, uh, sticking it to the mass. Yeah, sticking, sticking it to the, it to the Romans. They got the bars and that down there. They like Roman roads. So we thought, sod it. We're going to build a road of houses and we're going to do it semicircular. Yeah. Stick it to the man. <laughs> hey, what did the Romans ever do for us? Yeah, anyway? that's right. Yeah. Apart from, Apart from the baths and the roads and... Aqueducts, viaducts, <laughs> law and order. Yeah, all that sort of stuff, yeah. But roads. apart from that... What do they do for us? Well, viewers, that's it. That's the end of our tour of Bath. Um, I mean, one thing I'd like to say about Bath is it's not just about the Bath Abbey. No. Where else do we go? Uh, the Royal Crescent. Yeah, it's not just about the Royal Crescent. It's not just about the Roman baths. It's also about the great pubs. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>